Here are five huge updates for Ubisoft Massive's upcoming game, Star Wars Outlaws, with four updates that will have you even more excited about this first ever open world Star Wars title that has high stakes missions, spaceship fights, and an original story. And one update being somewhat of a disappointment. Yo, it's your boy James of Expect to Go, bringing you guys fun and positive gaming content. Starting with the biggest update so far, Ubisoft this week just announced their next Ubisoft Forward event of 2024. Ubisoft's huge and annual showcase featuring gameplay, news, and updates on upcoming game titles from the publisher. Ubisoft Forward 2024 event will be live in LA on June 10th, which by the way takes place the same week as Jeff Keighley's annual Summer Games Fest. The biggest gaming show of the summer with E3 no longer being a thing. So all the eyes of the gaming industry will be seeing what Ubisoft reveals with Star Wars Outlaws. Just a year ago, last June, during the same event, we got to see a ton of gameplay from Outlaws, which looked out of this world, pun intended. So with a confirmed 2024 release, expect a highly anticipated solid release date at this event or before on April 9th during the story trailer premiere tomorrow. Ubisoft Forward also looks to provide a new gameplay trailer that reveals even more features, plus a possible, fingers crossed, collector's edition reveal with the deluxe and standard versions of the game all available for pre-orders by the end of Ubisoft Forward event. Now, the reason I'm confident in Ubisoft announcing a Star Wars Outlaws release date, whether at Ubisoft Forward or at tomorrow's story trailer premiere, is simply because Outlaws has now been rated in the multiple regions as of the time I'm making this video, which is a huge update. The first rating was from South Korea Game Rating and Administration Committee posted in late March having a 19 plus age rating. The next rating, also late March, came from the Australian Classification Board where it was rated M for Mature with the final and more recent rating for Star Wars Outlaws coming from Brazil, with the Brazilian classification awarded to Star Wars Outlaws as not recommended for children under 14 years of age. Now, don't be alarmed by these ratings as they seem to be rated mature due to a gambling feature in the game, I believe thanks to a mini game. But, those three regional ratings are a huge update on the game's development state because in order to even rate the game, those regions have to play Outlaws in its entirety, indicating not only is there a playable version of the entire game of Star Wars Outlaws ready to be rated, but also that the release could be sooner than expected, which is an exciting update. Now, the big question is, how soon? Well, seeing that Ubisoft Star Wars Outlaws had now been rated in three countries, many industry insiders have pointed out that Ubisoft games that are rated specifically in South Korea typically launch in or around two to three months after. Recent examples of this include Avatar Frontiers of Pandora and Assassin's Creed Mirage, both releasing late 2023 which puts a release window of Star Wars Outlaws around this summer, between late May and September, backing up a huge insider gaming report back in January by Todd Henderson that claimed Star Wars Outlaws and Ubisoft were gunning for a first half of 2024 release date following its short delay announcement back in 2023. But with the recent Star Wars Outlaws story trailer announcement and the Ubisoft Ford event announcement for June 10th, I can see Star Wars Outlaws maybe moving out of the summer release window and into a fall window, allowing Ubisoft's marketing team to keep the hype per se going after the game's expected release date announcement. Also allowing the developers, Massive Entertainment, to polish up Star Wars Outlaws gameplay 
right before launch. To which the graphics and animations of the game, in my opinion, already look nothing short of pristine. Using the same engine as Avatar Frontiers of Pandora, which was a gorgeous game already. So even if Star Wars Outlaws ends up looking just 80% as good as the initial gameplay trailer, we are still going to be in for a treat, especially PC players that have high-end rigs with NVIDIA as showcased in Star Wars Outlaws recent promo trailer update, which PC players can look forward to. DLSS 3, ray tracing, and NVIDIA Reflex, delivering the ultimate PC experience thanks to GeForce RTX from NVIDIA. Hopefully though, Massive Entertainment allows Star Wars Outlaws on PC to have uncapped frame rate as well. Either way, this first open world Star Wars title we'll get our hands on will look and feel amazing to play and I cannot wait to get my hands on it. That being said, be sure to get the most out of what you can out of Star Wars Outlaws when it releases this year because we won't be getting a sequel anytime soon. Ubisoft revealed the news in a recent blog post discussing the future of Massive Entertainment and its own Julian Gerardi. Gerardi will soon transition back and continue to helm Ubisoft's popular Division series by working on The Division 3 and a number of other projects in the works, including mobile game The Division Resurgence and the action shooter The Division Heartland. But before this push begins, Ubisoft has made it clear that Star Wars Outlaws remains a priority for Gerardi and the Massive Entertainment team, and that they are all fully committed in making the game a huge success for Ubisoft and the developer. Meaning, even if Star Wars Outlaws is a huge fan and critic success, a sequel won't be in the works for a long time, at least by the same developer, Massive Entertainment, which honestly is a bummer. So here's hoping that Star Wars Outlaws is a self-contained story that has a satisfying ending and not so much of a cliffhanger ending, which leaves us wanting more, which is something we'll find out soon enough when Star Wars Outlaws releases sometime this year. Until then, count on us over at Expector Go to bring you guys the latest and greatest and fun and positive Star Wars Outlaws content. So be sure to subscribe and drop a like as it supports and helps spread the positivity from the channel. Special thanks to Patronus Squad who also supports our journey to a galaxy far, far away, specifically Cloud Roth and Cad Bane who had thoughts on our other Star Wars Outlaws video to your right. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Until next time.